Hello, what's up? Ali here. And today we will share how to load payloads on our PS4 using webhost with the PPPWN exploit. But first, what are the webhost? Webhost are the bread and butter of the PS4 jailbreak scene since day one. We can find payloads, cheats, mods, and other important stuff directly on some host using our PS4 web browser. But unfortunately, the latest jailbreak, which is a PPPWN, has a different chain of exploit, so it no longer uses webhost to load the jailbreak. But one of the developers has prepared some payloads that we can load using webhost. This way, it is a lot easier to load payloads compared to using external hard drive. First, let us go ahead and activate our jailbreak. And to be able to connect to a web host, we have to reconfigure our network and connect to the internet. So go back to the setup internet connection. Connect to your local Wi-Fi or LAN connection. Use custom, IP address automatic. And to be on the safe side, since we have to connect to the internet, it is highly advisable to use a DNS that blocks Sony updates. So on the DNS settings, use manual and use this DNS. Then check internet connection and you should have a successful check. Now go to the browser. You have to do this every time you want to update or change your host. But on a regular basis, you only need to connect to a web host once and it will save the data on your PS4. On the enter URL, enter this following address. After it caches, you no longer need internet connection to access this web host. You may leave your internet connection to PPPoE for the PPPWN exploit. Now this web host will have links, payloads, ready to load on your PS4. For now, these are the only available payloads for this web host for 11.0. But since we have already cracked this for 11.0, I'm sure it will only get better and will have more choices and options soon. To load a payload, you have to enable the bin loader first on your golden settings. So go to the server settings and check this. Now go back to the host and simply pick a payload you want to load. And since you are already here, go ahead and take advantage of disabling your updates. This will prevent any official firmware updates and will preserve your firmware version to avoid those accidental firmware updates. Now this may not be much for now, but uh, this simply gives us hope that maybe soon we can get a good support from web host even on our PPPWN exploit. And who knows, there may be some new chains of exploit soon that can also enable us to use web host to activate our jailbreak even on 11.0. So this will be it for now. If you have any questions or suggestions, simply leave them on our comment section and I will definitely address them. And again, my name is Ali. If you find this video helpful, please go ahead and like and subscribe. And I will definitely see you on our next video. Bye-bye.